Hello, it's the 23rd of um, May and I just want to show a little bit about summer pruning. If you remember the first um, video I made, I talked about the, the point of winter pruning and getting the tree into balance. Each year we want three things. The tree should make some new growth, it should produce some fruit buds and it should produce some fruit. And the purpose of pruning was to keep the tree in balance. But, but what do you do when the tree has reached its full size? Uh, these are Malingmut 106s and they've reached a full size and if I, I let these trees grow they will just keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger and I don't want that. Uh, so the, uh, although we want new growth, fruit bud and fruit, I'm going to be doing some summer pruning, I'll talk about it first and I'll do a short video to actually show you me doing it. Um, and the purpose of that is to restore a balance which in this case will be favouring this year's fruit the fruit bud that's being formed at the expense of new growth. So basically I'll be removing new growth, uh, thinning the tree out. I may take some fruit and some fruit buds off but mainly I'll be taking new growth off and doing this in the summer around about late May, June uh, is a style of pruning sort of um, after a Frenchman called Louis Lorette who um, developed the system. Seems counterintuitive and uh, you know, if you like life simple, you may not want to bother with it. But if you've got a re really thick tree like this, uh, you will improve the productivity of the tree. Um, and in particular, if you're going to use a restricted form of apple tree, such as a cordon, a fan, an espalier, or a dwarf pyramid, you're going to have to do that. And what I'm going to do essentially is going to go through here, I'm going to thin it out, I'm going to cut back a lot of this year's growth, I'm going to cut back, I'm going to make a lot of cuts which are going to cut uh, off the growth just above a fruit bud in last year's uh, wood. So when I finish the tree it's going to look a lot thinner, a little bit like these trees, a little bit like these trees which I have already uh, gone through and done this operation on. And if you look on the ground you can see quite a lot of fruit, uh, no sorry, quite a lot of um, new leaves. Most of that is this year's growth that I've cut off. Okay, well uh, we just finish that video and I'll show you me actually doing some.